This 10 foot by 12 foot medium quality canvas is about to become the sail for my SD11 sailing dinghy. Starting with the luff, which is also the baseline, I laid out my starting point. Next, I measured the foot and made a temporary mark at the clue. Measuring diagonally from the throat, I'm able to establish the actual clue. In laying out the head, I made a circular mark where the leech would intersect with the head at the peak. Then I measured the leech from the clue and marked my actual peak. Having established the tack, the throat, the clue and the peak, I got out my straight edge and connected the dots. I offset the head, the leech and the foot 3 inches and drew a line that would be my cut line. And since my straight edge was too short for the leech, I snapped that line. A good pair of scissors made it easy to cut. Like slicing through butter. My canvas had become my sail pattern. I bought a can of common contact cement. At this point I had no clue whether my canvas idea would work or not. While the cement dried, I laid out my grommet spacing at the luff. I figured three grommets between the existing ones would suffice. About an 8 inch spacing. By now the contact cement was ready and I made my first fold. Using my 6 inch drywall knife on a hard surface I double hem the head. I drew another line three inches from the edge and added more contact cement.
once pressed together, I had my finished triple M. After reinforcing the corners, I added the grommets, including one at the throat, the peak, and the clue. I picked up the grommet kit at Harbor Freight for about five bucks. All in all, it turned out to be a pretty decent sale, and for less than $30 at that.